Hey guys, welcome back to the Neon Nightcast Let's Play of Pokemon Fire Red. This is Eric Dr. Soybean. <clears throat> and it's me, Thrax. I'm here too, guys. Can you hear me? <laughs> guys? Heard ya. Sure guys, did. Guys, 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 guys. So now we'll watch this old man do his thang. Thang, 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 thang. Even though we've uh, already caught a Pokemon. Can we do the Missingo glitch in this game? I don't think you can. I think they removed that, didn't they? Yeah, 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 yeah. They did, they did. So last time we wasted a bit of its time trying to uh, find a Pokemon that wasn't there, but... Everyone was screaming at us. Now we know what we're doing. Everyone was red-faced, screaming at their computer and or cell phone. I never used the TGTV. Just like, it's not there! Oh, and you missed an item back there. Where? Beside that tree. You can't cut it yet. No, go down. Go down. Go a little bit left. Ring, ding, dong. Ah, oh, clever boy. Clever girl. <laughs> <laughs> so we can get uh person x though i don't know maybe people actually don't know who we're talking about then maybe now. maybe they don't we never i mean how would they know what we thought was there well players of the original pokemon they would probably like know. red and red and blue well no. only only 90s kids will understand that only 90s kids though they did they did do a re-release of red and blue on the 3ds oh so that was pretty cool of them. That is. Viridian Forest. Oh, are they? Well, I might well, be. Well, go left able... first. Why? Because there's items. Do you not like items? You remember, like, every fucking... Yeah, Up dude. or left? Uh, go up. Oh. And then there, one... there might be one down to the left. But okay. I'm not... Really sure. Wild Weedle. No, I don't want to train up a Kakuna. No, me neither. I was gonna say Magikarp if we picked Bulbasaur, but uh, no, I think Squirrel's a good choice too. I just like, I just, I'm always, I always pick the Grass Starter. Honestly. Yeah. Well, I just except don't. Except for okay, Pokemon Sun and Moon. I don't like Rowlet at all. Uh, sometimes I'll pick Infernape. Whoops. Uh, sometimes, oh, uh, an item. see, Ruby and Sapphire, I almost always, okay, let's start at the beginning. Red and blue? <laughs> yeah. Always Bulbasaur, okay. Uh, gold and silver, either Philalligator or Typhlosion. What about uh, Totodile? Oh, that's Philalligator. Okay. Um... Uh, what's the other one? Ruby and Sapphire. Honestly, it's a mix between all of them. Like, I, I, I like them all equally. Mm -hmm. Trico, Mudkip, and uh, Torchic. Diamond and Pearl, which is the newest one that I've played, I was very disappointed with the uh, water uh, starter. He ended up being my worst Pokemon on my team. Yeah. Um, yeah, I, I either go with Chimchar or... God, what the hell is the grass one? Uh, uh, it starts with a G. I can Anyways, grass, it, but... grass or fire. Uh, Generation 5, always do the grass one. It's the only one that is looks cool at all. Mm -hmm. uh, six. They all suck. Uh, if you put a gun to my head, I'd probably take Greninja. The water. And then six, I don't like any of them. I don't like any of six? them. Six, or you just said seven, and then you went back to six. Oh right, seven, seven. I don't like any of them, at all. They're all garbage. Is seven sun and moon? Yeah. Yeah, you said you were really disappointed with that, right? Yeah. But yeah, like so, you know, most of the time grass, and sometimes fire, sometimes water, but. I don't know, like, Bulbasaur was my shit when I was a kid. 
and I just always kind of saw myself as grass. Like, if I had to pick one <laughs> from like Ruby and Sapphire, right? I'd probably go with the grass one, uh, Trico. You saw yourself as grass when you should have been seeing yourself smoking it. Well, I was always smoking it. That's why I was like, they like the grass types, man. Fuck them in the ass. Smoke them in the grass. Right. I, I, I was not a, I'm not a smoker. <clears throat> But, um, hell, what was I going to say? What I didn't like about Sun and Moon, I never played it, but, like, from what I saw about it, I thought the, uh, uh, Team Rocket proxy in that game looked really stupid. No, it's one of the best ones! They look dumb as hell. No. Okay, see, Team Skull was actually, like, one of the only good redeeming parts of that, of those games. Because... I didn't mind the team from, uh, Diamond and Pearl. They were all No, right. Diamond and Pearl, it's so uninspired. What was their uh, whole deal again, though? What was their goal? Something to do with, like, remaking the universe or something. Oh, yeah. I just thought they looked kind of cool. I didn't really care about their goal. Oh, so they, like, they all got really, like, kind of just boring and shit, and then Team Ska was so out of nowhere. Like, the one in Generation 6, they're awful. It's the worst team. What is and it? It's, uh, team Flare. They're about, like, being rich and, like, well-dressed. And then like, <laughs> they just want to, like... The guy wants to become immortal and, like, kill everyone or something. And it's just kind of like... Yeah. And then they made Team Skull, and they're just, like, gangsters that like to, like, cause trouble. That's awesome. They look dumb, though. So, like, nothing will beat Team Rocket from this game and the next game. Yeah. No, I mean, they're that's just the classic. The yeah. Damn you, Stanky. Stanky. Hanky Stanky. Should I let Ape take out this one? No. Yeah. It's gonna take, like, all day. Like, just just use Stankers. Yeah. Ouch. Aw, oh, we're not using a fossil Pokemon. That makes me sad. Fossil Pokemon are always my favorite. Yeah, they do have a lot of cool ones. A lot of the coolest Pokemon are, like, the ones from the fossils. I just kind of like prehistoric stuff. I have to say one of my all-time favorite Pokemon. I absolutely loved him when I played through Pearl. My fucking, uh, Drift Blim, man. Yeah, you loved him, man. He was sweet. Yeah, Ghost Flying. Yeah. He's, like, a really good wall. Uh, so what do you want to do? Dome Fossil or Helix Fossil? Um, I don't really care, to be honest. I'll let you choose that. Gotta go with Kabuto, man. Kabuto's way better than Omastar. I never used either of them, to be honest. I used, I've used i used Aerodactyl in, uh, like, Generation 1 playthroughs before, but I've never used, uh, either of those two. Yeah. Did you? Yeah, I used I used Kabutops a lot, man. I like I like that Pokemon a lot. Um, maybe I'll switch one of my picks for. But we already have a Water type, so I really don't see a point actually. Yeah. Oh, you know what? I uh. Whatever. One of our Pokemon is a trading Pokemon. And we're gonna have to save. What do you mean we're gonna Maybe. have to save? Because you have to save before you go into the trade area. Well, we're gonna have to change we'll Pokemon We'll figure, well, no, nah, we'll figure out where we might just use the, the, the lower version. Yeah. We'll figure it out. I'm sure there's something that we can just do in the options of the emulator to make it have a battery. Yeah, as long as it doesn't... Uh, yeah, I don't know. We have a save state, so... Yeah. Yeah. Well, why don't I just do a little research while I... No, can... no, no. You need to be free to commentate, so oh, don't do I it can now. comment and do this. What do you talk uh... about? I do this shit all the time. Eric, you what you're gonna do? You're a dying man talking all this bullshit, and my life's in your hands. Said I don't know, no. 
uh, what is that? That's a uh, coach's theme from WWE. Right. Could you, you see that. him? Oh, oh, oh. Could That's you see John him? Cena, Mike. Uh. For oh. some reason, I remember the anime. Yeah, okay, it's, it's literally just under the options. Oh, okay. So we'll be fine. For some reason, I remember the anime really well when they're in uh, Viridian Forest and Ash, Ash catches his uh, Pidgeotto and Caterpie and uh, Caterpie, like, freaks out Misty. Yeah, and he, like, just wants to love her and then he evolves to Metapod and everyone's like, he's useless and then, like, he believes in him. Yeah. And then he evolves to Butterfree and he loved Butterfree and then Butterfree left for that pink skank. <laughs> <laughs> And I like, actually, I don't, I don't I remember was that. I so never. So sad when Butterfree left, man. Really? See, yeah. I don't remember that because I was I'd stopped watching by then. But I do remember when Ash traded his Butterfree when he was aboard the SSN. But then he felt bad about it and traded back. Yeah. You remember that? Then, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then he gave him away for that. Oh, let's fight this Tisnocker. Gave it away. He traded it away. His Pidgey evolved. His Pidgeotto evolved at the end of the Pokemon, the first series. It took so long. And then he gave it away, or released it, that episode. What? Seriously? Yeah. So it finally became a Pidget, and then he just released it. Yeah. Wow, what an idiot. Hey, he's a dumb, dumb, stupid, stinky, dumb, dumb head. A big, stupid, doo-doo head. A big, stupid, doo-doo head. That man, that man used to be a hero. <laughs> now he's you, just a zero. Do you remember, uh... Like, do you remember actually watching that show, though, back in the day? Yeah, the, those kids said the darndest things, man. <laughs> They'd always be like, it was like the cheesiest show in existence, though. To be like, now here's Cause and the kids. And just it'd just be like, what does your mommy say when he gets when she gets mad at you? And it's like, she tells me to go sit in my room. Sit in your room? <sighs> like I don't know. It was like. <laughs> I don't know, like, no, maybe and it was show was actually hilarious, but, like... And it was stuff like, um... He'd be like, so you wanna be a pirate? And the kid's like, yeah. And he's like, yo-ho-ho ho, and a bottle of rum. And the kid's like, yeah. And he's, and then he'd be like, and a pretty woman, too. And the kid would be like, no. <laughs> like, he would say things that he knew would get, like, a reaction out of kids. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. That was the whole fucking thing of the show. Yeah. Those kids, man, they just... I don't know, we, we really... Why do you use news bubble, man? Because I'm almost out of fucking PP, and there's a couple more people we gotta fight. Man, you crazy. Hello? Well, he's raising our defense, so it does zero damage. Well, he can suckle my sack. Uh... Where was I going with this? What were we just talking about? A big stupid oh. <laughs> dude, Red. <laughs> Yo, my cat is not so right now, man. I can hear him. Wow. The hell is he doing? He just gets excited and he likes running around the house. Yeah, I remember when mine was was that energetic. He still sometimes gets like pissed up and runs around, but now he just he sleeps a okay. lot more. Use use one bubble. All right, all right, oh. all right. It because it should it'll probably kill it. Oh. oh. So did you, did you know? Did you know? Uh, when you crit in Pokemon, it negates all stat buffs, right? Does it really? I did not know yeah, that. Yeah. So he had he had six hardens up, so he had maximized his defense. Right. That oh. Crit. oh, catch it. Yeah, he's rare in here. 
Um, rare. We're gonna have to switch because I think one hit will kill him. Because he's only level three. Yeah, okay. <clears throat> uh, yeah, so that crit just basically ma made like all those stat ups mean nothing. Oh, that's sweet. Scratch it, Coco. Use the scratch attack. Ah. Uh, static. Let's try to give him at least one more. Oh, just keep going until he, he drops. I don't want to accidentally kill him, though. He's using Growl. I know. What if we crit him? I don't do that much. It didn't even do a quarter. Ah! Uh, oh, come on. Oh, uh -oh. there you go. Alright, well... Uh, start throwing balls. Yeah. And hope this Thunder Shock doesn't... Um. Yeah, I guess that's all we can do. It might actually, it might actually catch him. He's only level three, for God's sake. For God's sake, he's only level three. Yes. Hey, nice. He just he gets excited when I get home after working twenty-eight hours a day. Uh, um, Bichu. What about ha ha ha? Bichu, like he's a bee. All right. Ha ha ha. B ah. Uh, whoops. B ah. Uh, Bichu. Nice. Oh. Or must it, oh, oh, I was going to yell at you, boy. You knew I was going to yell at you, and you knew you weren't going to like it. I'd say, why are you tickling me like that? I like that. What the fuck? <laughs> Family guy. <laughs> Can we level up our Pikachu enough that his Thunderbolt will, like, hurt the Onyx? What we're gonna have to do is, like, go to a mill and attach wires to his cheeks and then ride a yeah. bike to turn the wheel, so it... You yeah. remember that? Like, instead of just, like, having Ash capture a Pokemon that could, like, affect ground types, they right. decided to just, like, destroy the structure of the universe. Yeah. That was really dumb, actually. It's like, we must use Pikachu. You know what was funny is, um, I remember reading, if you look at, like, a lot of the really early promotional Pokemon art and stuff, uh, Clefairy was very prominently featured. Like, they basically knew the, that there'd be, like, a very cute Pokemon that would end up becoming, like, you know, yeah, a no, lot no. of people's Clefairy, favorite. Clefairy was chosen to be, like, the poster child. Yeah, they thought, and they like, thought, like, you know, he'd be the most popular. Yeah, and then Pikachu fucking exploded. Yeah, Pikachu just, just like came out of nowhere, man. People just loved him. Exploded all over everything. Well, every like Japanese schoolgirl was like, so kawaii. <laughs> That's literally what they said, viewers. <laughs> literally. All right, I actually shouldn't have used that potion. I didn't. Re I thought we had another battle before. Uh... Peter, no, you f fool! <laughs> <laughs> There's that guy in that gym that talks about being light years away. Oh yeah, that's not proper science, huh? Um, hello, how much dumber could you be? How really? much fucking stupid are you doing? Well, viewers, let's head to the gym and take out... Where the fuck is the gym? B-Rock. Up to the top, top Let, left. Let's head to the gym and take out Brock. Next time. Oh, next time. Okay, I, I didn't know what you were going to say. <laughs> this time, next time, the next time after. We'll see you then, viewers. Bye.